Yo, it's your boy Meets Two Times in the building, Mr. Get Right and Get Left, man. Welcome back to another episode of Real Talk with M2X. Bruh, I'ma just hop right into it, bro. This shit ruined my life, bro. And in so many aspects, in so many, so many different ways, bro. This shit, pornography, masturbation, all that shit, bro. That shit literally took a toll on every section of my life, bro. And I'm making this video today because, like, bro, <laughs> it's like a never-ending cycle, man. And, like, I I don't want to be the type of motherfucker to hop on here and preach to y'all and not, not practice what I'm preaching, bro. And this video is not for nobody to feel bad for me, not to just sit up here and tell y'all, oh give y'all a side story it's not bro it's because this shit is real bro and i'm i'm gonna be 100 tr percent transparent bro like i just left it's 9 30 in the morning i just left from a, the girl that i'm messing with house bro and like anytime we try to do something i can't you know get hard or nothing bro or when i do I can't finish or I go soft like midway or when we switch positions, bro. And it's like, this shit is embarrassing. It's constantly, she's telling me, I feel like you're not attracted to me. So she's getting frustrated. She's getting upset. She's getting mad. Then I'm being embarrassed and shit like that, bro. And this shit is just like, it's like, what the fuck do I do, bro? Like, <laughs> I don't know, bro. Like, is like from anxiety from depression it's like that's the drug that that i personally run to or some shit like that but that's causing it even more when i'm feeling down when i'm feeling stressed or something i run to that but running to that it's causing that. So it's a repeating cycle, bro. And like I said, it's taking a toll on everything. I don't be getting shit done. And, bro, like, I'm just tired of this shit, bro. Honestly, bro. Because do you know how fucking embarrassing it is when you're trying to do something with a girl that you like? And, and you constantly have to keep telling her shit and it sounds like excuses because she don't understand it? Like, that shit is embarrassing, bro. That shit is very embarrassing, bro. And it's like, I don't expect them to understand even when I try to explain it to them. But it's still like, if I was in her shoes and that shit kept happening to me, one, I'm probably going to feel like, yeah, he don't like me. But two, like, that's probably going to start fucking up what me and them got going on. And it might start causing problems or being like, well, I'm losing interest in you. We can't do nothing. So it's like, I don't know, man. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just leave the video like that. I hope y'all had a good Thanksgiving. I know I ain't been on here like that. Um, but bro, this shit is. I don't know what to do, bro. Honestly. I don't know what to do. Cause I don't know, bro. Like and 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 I don't I don't I don't care, bro. I'm a, I'm a I'm a I'm a speak the truth, bro. I'm gonna speak the truth, bro. This is personal. This is I don't I don't care who's watching, bro. If this video gets a million views, bro, y'all gonna know something personal about me, bro. So. Ever since nine years old, I've been addicted to that shit, right? And it's progressively gotten into more stuff. Where it's gotten into me, the last girl that I was with, me imagining other guys doing stuff to her or stuff like that, bro. Basically, cut coding, bro. And that, I feel, that's, that's what really fucked me up, bro. That's what really fucked me up. Like, imagine other guys doing stuff with her turned me on bro and you want to know why it turned me on because i would because we watch other unless you watch girls on girls or solo girl videos bro you all a cup too 
I'm just being a hundred. You watch another guy or multiple guys fuck a girl, bro. So that shit progressively changed your mind after thinking, oh yeah, that's what sex is like. That's what's supposed to feel good. Me watching somebody else do something to her. Now, really, if somebody did that to my girl, I wouldn't enjoy that. I would, I would, I would be mad. I would be fucking upset. But the thought of it, that shit turned me on, bro. And I think that's really what fucked me up, bro. Really, honestly. Because it would be points in time where, not with the girl that I'm talking to now, the last girl that I was dealing with, I would have to imagine things like, oh, her being a slut or her being a hoe. Or just a whole bunch of shit, bro. And that, <laughs> like, I don't know, bro. And, and, and this situation of me not getting hard or, you know, can't finish or being getting soft and stuff that shit happened in the past like with every other girl but for a little bit i've i cured it but it's like now it's 10 times worse and somebody that i'm actually fucking with like i can't perform bro and i know it's probably performance anxiety it's stress that i'm going through right now it's a lot of shit bro but I don't know, bro. I'm asking y'all for help, bro. And I know my channel is supposed to be giving y'all help, but I'm asking y'all for help, bro. Like, what do, what do I do, bro? What do I do? I I don't know what to fucking do, bro. I don't got no male role model in my life. I don't got no support from my family. And this is this not even tying into just watching porn, bro. It's with the childhood trauma. It's with just like when you don't have an outlet to run to, either a male figure or family or something like that. What do people run to? Drugs, addictions. So I don't know, man. I'm I'm honestly not even sure what to fucking do at this point, bro. And I hate to make this type of video because, like I said, on my channel, I want to inspire y'all and teach y'all things. But I, like I said, I can't teach somebody something. I can't help other people if I can't help myself, honestly. And I don't want to be known as, oh, Meech is a, a fraud. Meech is, a, Meech is just telling us lies or some shit. No, that's not what I want to do, bro. So I'm going to be 100 with y'all. Like, this is really how I'm feeling right now. And I don't know what to do. Like, I feel lost. So, I don't know, man. But if, 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 if you're going through the same shit, bro, hit me up. If you went through this shit and you know the, the, the ways to fix this, bro, just let me know. Because this shit is getting to the point where it's like, I don't know what the next step is, bro. I don't. Like, every everything, everything that I do in my life, this shit has an effect on it. Whether I be at the gym, whether it be my social anxiety, whether it be me going to talk to a fucking girl, bro. But, oh, I'll be on Instagram and I'll go check. I, I'll follow a girl. And I used to slide in the DM, but I barely do that anymore. Like, what? Well, I don't know, bro. Like, I need to get confidence, bro. And I don't know, bro. It's so much shit. I don't even know what to say no more, man. But if y'all watching this video, man, I'm asking for help, bro. This, this, this is my call out to help in other aspects of my life, bro. Because I don't got nobody I can run to. I don't got a good connection with family. I don't got no friends to run to, bro. So, yeah, um, I'll catch y'all in the next video, man.